So this is the Zimbabwe lineup: uh, Chengetai, Katuma, uh, Gertrude Masora, Charity Mukukuti, Barbara Shumba, Tatenda Chitewe, Precious Pazani, Rudo Maposa, Singobile Mpofu, Ruvimbo, Tabeka, Precious Marange, and Abigail Kawonza. Zimbabwe in the white and green strip ring from left to right on your screens and Namibia in the blue strip. from Zimbabwe. They mean business here. Zimbabwe, a very great playing rugby nation on this continent. Qualified for the 1991 Rugby World Cup. But now it's the ladies who are, who are doing their country proud. Off to a very good start so far. Building up a few faces here and there. Let's see what they can do with this ball, and that will be for the viewers. But I think the referee, you know, when the referee has, has given it, has given it by the way. So it's still Zimbabwe ball. Zimbabwe attacking Namibia. Zimbabwe playing from, from, I mean, playing from left to right. Namibia in the blue and white. Zimbabwe in the usual colors of white and green. And Zimbabwe on the attack here. They must most of it to score a try. And no, the referee has penalized them. They were virtually no on the try line. Unfortunate knock on there Scrum. when the try line was actually beckoning. Yes, Blue's ball. Was beckoning. And uh, it's going to be an Namibia feed to the scrum. Zimbabwe versus Namibia. Two great rivals of the African continent in the men's game. Meet in the women's game. Bind! And uh, Set. Namibia with the feed <laughs> to the scrum, but it's been stolen by the Zimbabweans. And Zimbabwe on the attack, and they look like suddenly to score a try here. And she goes. And the ball is advantage. Open, and it's going okay. to be advantage, but the referee plays on advantage. Namibia now trying to get out of their half. What can they do? But they're being tackled ferociously. Okay. The Zimbabweans. First time Namibia actually has the possession. It's been all cool. Zimbabwe from the kickoff. Stringed a uh, couple of faces moving up to about 60 meters from the territory. And uh, just as the trial no was opening, they decided to lose the ball. It yeah, must be very disappointing for them. Absolutely. Hold on to the ball for, for, for so long and just lose out on the last couple of meters. Yes. Uh, they, they, they look certainly to squat try there. They were attacking with intent. But so far, uh, they've not had the results Set. yet. It's a Namibia scrum, and then in the Namibians win it, and they kick stay, it stay. out. They kick it stay, no back time, to stay. the center. I thought in yeah, sevens, the whole idea was to retain possession as much as you can. It would be interesting to see how the Zimbabwean team manages to maintain the tempo because they, they are actually not keeping the ball into the breakdown phase. Soon as they okay, go into the rack, player pops the ball out and it's been ball dynamic open. over and over again. That must definitely be taking a toll on their bodies. Yes, uh, it must be taking a toll on their bodies, as, as you're saying. Uh, but what can they, the no Zimbabweans have looked much of the sharper side okay, so release. far? Wow. But this ball has been stolen there by Namibia. What can Namibia do with this ball? The Namibians look big, very strong, and uh, whoa, good play there by Namibia. Taking the ball up to the halfway line. No. Happens everywhere in the world when someone with a number one, number two, number three and jersey runs with the ball. One expects them to dump. And the ball has been stolen there, and the. Zimbabwe is playing a foot race. They're kicking it, kicking it, kicking it. And the referee will not award that try. Penalty, yeah? Try time. Oh, on no, the try. Not a try. It looks like he's awarded a penalty. There must have been a knock on there. Or was it a try? So I'm wondering, was uh, the whistle to me sounded like a try there? Uh, it was a it try. It is a try. So Zimbabwe leading here with a try. They've looked the sharper team so far in this game. And. Uh, Conversion is good and Zimbabwe leading by seven points to nil here in the second match of the Captain, Confederation Captain of African Rugby Tournament. Zimbabwe Captain seven, Blue. Namibia Captain zero. Blue. For all viewers joining I don't us from tripping, Kenya okay? and across Afri the African yeah. continent, tell we welcome tell you to the 2014 Confederation of African Rugby Women's Tournament let's being played in Machakos, 60 kilometers away from the capital of let's Kenya, play, Nairobi. Let's play. Um, second game of the day. First game actually ended in favor of Madagascar 1914, and second game currently ongoing is the first pool B fixture. Behind kicker. Playing between Zimbabwe Can and you run? Yes, now Zimbabwe kicking the ball and restarting this game. Uh, the Namibians have just showed us in flashes a bit of their form, but haven't really built anything in terms of phases. It's all been Zimbabwe so far. And Zimbabwe will kick this ball uh, and it'll go out and it'll be a line out 
for the Zimbabweans. For the Namibians, sorry. Blue Zimbabwe ball. finished fifth at last year's championships and uh, hope to get one better in this year's event, be played in Nairobi. And uh, from the opening uh, exchanges against Namibia in this game, they look like um, they are quite sharp. Yes, they, they look very sharp. Stay and, ten. Uh, ten. It's going to be a line out for Namibia. What can Namibia do? Can they respond? Well, well, their old ball has been stolen there, and Zimbabwe on the attack again. Tackler release. Look to be no hands. A bit of a spot of brother here. They seem to be in sixes and sevens. It was their line out feed. They lost the ball, and now Zimbabwe going to punish them with a second try. Zimbabwe with a second try here. Zimbabwe look absolutely stunning. They look very dangerous with ball in hand, and Zimbabwe scored in their second try. Zimbabwe have scored their second try of the tournament and it's going to be 12 nil, probably going to 14. <laughs> Punishing the mistakes of, uh, of the Namibians so far. Namibia really struggling to get out of their own half. They seem very clueless in attack. Time your run. And they have been punished by a very rampant Zimbabwe side here. It's a Zimbabwe 14, Namibia 0. Two tries by Abigail Kawonza. Looks uh, silkier of the running players in this particular game. And uh, that's the difference in the match. Scoring both of Zimbabwe's tries, Abigail Kawonza. Looks like a player to watch out for in this year's event. Yeah, she's been outstanding. She's been absolutely fantastic. In the two game in, in 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 this match already, and Namibia with all to do here. What can Namibia do in this release game? Release the no hands. They haven't got out of their own half. They have been Not punished releasing. here by very strong Zimbabwe outfit. Now they have the ball now. Namibia, what can they do? That to me looks like a forward, forward. pass. No advantage. <laughs> Zimbabwe caught uh, offside. There. Release. You can uh, see the speed of the initial exchanges taking the toll on the players. Mm. They all have their arms on their head and um, some lazy runners got back, caught back. in the offside line back. there by the referee. So um, just like I predicted, the pace of the game clearly looking like taking a toll on the players right now. Yes, uh, it's looking like the pace of the game is taking a toll on the players. Players with hands on hips. And uh, let's see what Namibia can do. They, they haven't got out of their own half. Can they do something with this ball? Namibia, of course, making their first appearance at the Confederate of Africa Rugby Women's Tournament. Rampaging run in there, but held up by the Zimbabweans who are very well aware that the buzzer has gone and they okay, just need to off. get this one off so they can get a breather. Namibia retained possession. They've got runners out in there. They just need to get the ball out wide. Zimbabweans looking like they're struggling to do the cover defense. Um, and no, somehow they managed to just run into the defense. Not a good idea for me. I thought the uh, Namibians should have gone out wider. And then the pass should have been longer. And that should have been a try for Namibia. Come on. Like it's been held up. You need to lose that, it. Uh, and Namibia missing a golden chance there to score a try. <laughs> and it's half time. Half time. Zimbabwe 14, Namibia nil. The Confederation of African Rugby Tournament here in Machakos. Zimbabwe the much stronger side in the first half. Looking sharp and looking stronger. Abigail Kawonza scoring both tries. And Namibia, well, they'll have to come back in the second half. A stronger side and show more fight and commitment. Ben. Ben. Hello, when you pass, you spill it off. You have to be clear for the ball. And when you ball, you have to say, you have to say, man. Okay. You have to draw the field. Hold up, um, up, um, uh, to make contact. Maak. Play the ball away, man. And keep playing out of debt. And run straight. We need to see the straight lines of running. And communicate with each other. You can't play like amateurs now. Come on, guys, man, you, you're going to fix it now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Baby, you, what you must do when you come back? Then you get your running lines and run straight. Okay, took so. Then you play, play, play closer to her. When you play closer, then you 
Wat ben je hier? Ready behind, back, number one, back, back. And uh, Zimbabwe about to start off the second half. And they will be, they will be kicking to the Namibia half. And that ball, well, has across the 10 meter line, so it will be advantage to Namibia. Abigail Kowans with a dreadful kick off in the end. Just back. gifting Namibia with the possession in the start of the second half. That's what Namibia needed, by the way. Let's see what they can do with the ball. Uh, once again, the passing, not the best of, from Namibia and uh, Zimbabwe looking absolutely strong here. They have a two-man overlap and that will certainly be another try for Zimbabwe. An error from Namibia there and Zimbabwe scored their third try. Strong oh, hand up there by Rubimbo Privilege. Had only one player to beat and the lazy runner actually realized that there was a lot more intention from Ruvimbo who smashed her into the ground on her way to scoring the try in the center post. And it all started with that misplaced pass from Namibia which was stolen by uh, Precious Bazani. And from there they walked the ball through their faces, hands and Zimbabwe now leading 20, okay leading 19 points today on the conversion. Very poor there but it's 19 nil to Zimbabwe. Conversion manages, manages to get in between the poles but under the crossbar. Under the crossbar. So more of a goal there. Give me a round. Goal there than a conversion. Number one. And uh, Zimbabwe looking every bit strong here in this match so far. Scores remain at 19 points to Zimbabwe. Namibia 0. 19 Zimbabwe. Namibia 0. Namibia trying to string a couple of passes through but well covered there by the Zimbabweans who retain their discipline they they just on the person up and there it or lose it from the from the from the from the dead ball yes. should actually push them out should actually push them out and it's going to from. be a strong feed for Zimbabwe Green's ball with an Namibian attacker they are being held up perhaps not too confident with their lineouts and uh, instead preferring yeah. to go for the scrum down there the scrum down there yes absolutely we actually saw we saw both Senegal and Madagascar struggling in their line of department yes, in the first game. In the first game, it's perhaps one Coach. area that we've actually seen Bye. both teams struggling so far. Four teams struggling so far, yes. And Zimbabwe looking very strong. What can they do from here? Zimbabwe on the attack again. Abigail Kawonza spreads the ball out to Katumba. Katumba runs all the way. Katumba does not look like she needs any of the support. Managers Katla, get seven. smashed about 15 meters away and Kawonza pops up to support her teammate having started the move and Kawonza looks like she's getting her hat trick in this game. Oh Zimbabwe <laughs> really really Zimbabwe. outplaying the Namibians yet that's the fourth try for Zimbabwe so far and it'll take the score to 24 points to zero. Namibia just look like out of out of their depth so far in this game they are not actually piling on the pressure on Zimbabwe we are seeing so many lost balls in contact and they are being punished for every mistake by the Zimbabwe. And Zimbabwe now leading 26 points to zero. 26 nil to Zimbabwe. Precious Maranga very sure the conversion in there. Must have probably chided herself for missing the previous one. Uh, which went below the crossbar. <laughs> which went below the crossbar. Definitely very certain with that one. Abigail Kawonza, a hat trick here for the Zimbabwean team in this particular game and already top prize scorer in the tournament. Top score, yeah, already we, we, from, from the first game. The Namibians just don't seem to be in this game at all. Precious Try decides to go short in there. Definitely expected the Namibians kick oh, an over Oh, she <laughs> looks not for the ball. Right there. Oh, she I was in an offset position. position, yes. And it's going to be another penalty here for Zimbabwe. But I thought the ball should have gone into a breakdown for it to have been declared offside. The ball just kept on passing. Abigail Kawonza takes a quick one. No one home. And Abigail Kawonza scores half a try. 
31 points to zero. 31 points to zero. That's another try. And once again, Namibia caught asleep. Uh, Namibia caught asleep, and Zimbabwe piling on the points here. Piling on the points. Very emphatic display of total rugby by Zimbabwe in this particular game. They're definitely a team to watch out on Precious Marange. Good with the conversion. 33 points to zero, and Zimbabwe are signaling the intention of perhaps uh, getting into the winner's uh, role in this yes. year's tournament. Yeah, looking every bit strong here in this game so far. They have completely outplayed the Namibians. And uh, with still another two and a half minutes to go, not a, not a happy scholar if you're a Namibian uh, fan, uh, because with two minutes remaining, uh, Namibia trailing 33 points to zero and looking looking lost so far in the game. Yeah, looking lost, and uh, the Zimbabwe's will fancy themselves reaching 50 plus points in this game. Tackler release. The Namibians are attacking, but they match in their own half. Now they've got a, they've got a, they have got echoes on space on the left hand side, but once again, forward pass. The execution from. that pass was forward. And it will be a Zimbabwe ball with uh, one and a half minutes left in this game. The Confederation of African Rugby Tournament match number two between Zimbabwe and Namibia. Two very strong African sides in the, in, we, we, in the men's category right now, fighting out in the women. And so far, it looks very one sided. Zimbabwe taking Rouch. Namibia to the cleaners, leading by 33 Bang. points to nil here in Machakos. Set. As compared to Madagascar, who also making the maiden appearance in the car women's event. Namibia look like that of source. Madagascar look a lot more confident, had a, had an ability to be able to read the game, spread the board out well, quite well, and managed to punish the Senegalese team who have uh, been in this tournament before having finished 16 last year's event. Line out. Yes. Namibia, on the other hand, need to perhaps sit back and understand what they need to do to get something out of this event, perhaps. Yes, absolutely. They they seem to be rattling. I mean, I mean they seem to be out of out of depth. And uh, they are not building green, so green, many faces. They are not even holding on to their ball. They are being in that out. position. And uh, Tanel, yeah? you cannot play this game without okay. the ball. Okay. They need to do, hold on to the ball and probably work their way into a couple of phases. But so far, it's all been Zimbabwe here as they lead by 33 points to nil. Zimbabwe definitely getting a very clean line out in there. Okay, tackler release. Twisting and turning, Onside. moving about 15 meters, drawing in the Nabibia defense. And they look like they have space outside. I don't think they'll need. They decide to run in short, but they lose the ball, Advantage, unfortunately, no in contact right there. Yes. Very promising move. And the ball is lost in contact, but still, Zimbabwe look very menacing. The, Namibi the, 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 the Namibians are in their own half. Advantage what can they do over. with this ball? They, ball? they they kick it, and that very very nicely covered in there by Zimbabwe. Buzzer having gone final score, Zimbabwe emphatic winners over Namibia, 33.0. Yeah, okay.